Prince William is his daughter's superhero and is seemingly wrapped around her little fingers. The relationship between the two of them is so sweet that many royal watchers can't help but notice. Keep watching as we spill the truth about Prince William's relationship with his daughter. Princess Charlotte is the second child of Prince William and Princess Catherine and is the third in line to the throne, not being surpassed by her younger brother's birth with respect to the Succession to the Crown Act amended in 2013. For someone always busy with royal duties, the Prince of Wales has been commended for his commitment to family and Charlotte seems to have taken a large part of his heart. Because of the way she interacts with her siblings, the little princess is thought to have good leadership traits but remains a baby to her father. Prince William announced her birth on their Twitter account in a post made on May 2nd, 2015, stating that his wife, the Duchess of Cambridge, was safely delivered of a daughter at 8.34am at St Mary's Hospital. Her birth made the prince so happy for becoming a girl dad. Although William was delighted to meet his daughter, he felt the weight of fatherhood in the months before her birth. A few weeks before the birth of Princess Charlotte, he addressed a gathering during a walkabout indicating that number one is a life changer and that number two is a game changer. It was reported that the couple did not find out the sex of their baby while Princess Kate was pregnant, so they were elated when it was a girl, although he felt he wasn't prepared to be a girl dad. Prince William confessed in a Vietnamese talk show that he is struggling because parenthood isn't easy, stating that the alteration from being a single, independent man to going into a marriage and then having children has changed his life. He was thankful for the presence of his wife as she's been so supportive and her presence as a woman was helpful because while growing up it was just him and his brother Prince Harry without a sister. So he admits having a daughter was a different dynamic and he is learning about having a girl in the family, not minding his inexperience with little girls. The responsibility of becoming a new father is so much that William found it challenging having two young children at home and he made this clear during an appearance at the Welsh Rugby Charitable Trust in 2016 where he said that they, Prince George and Princess Charlotte, haven't broken a bone yet but they were trying. He added that they keep running around and pushing things and jumping and he wished it would get easier. If you want to be part of our family, quickly subscribe to our channel and turn on your notification bell so we can keep spilling the royal tea. Raising kids in the British dynasty is a duty that has largely been left to nannies, but just like his mother, Prince William wants the lives of his children as normal as possible that defies royal stereotypes. He tries to be close to the children, knowing what they are up and about. He told CNN, that midwives were bewildered when he was the one that changed Prince George's first nappy. He is determined to be a better father to his kids than his father King Charles was to him, by not allowing his royal duties to affect his relationship with his children. So many times little Princess Charlotte has been compared to her grandmother, Princess Diana, who died years ago in an accident. Her death was so devastating for Prince William and years after, he admits he is still yet to get over the shock, adding he is just learning to live with it. Although dead, Diana lives ever after in their hearts because Charlotte was named after her. She was fully named Charlotte Elizabeth Diana. He is also making sure to keep her legacy by bringing up the kids accordingly, making their lives as normal as possible. In an ITV documentary, he said he makes sure the kids know about her by constantly talking about her and having a lot of photos up around the house. Just like Princess Diana had a strong effect on the fashion industry, Charlotte is towing the same path, as the Charlotte effect is currently putting her on a fashion pedestal. Being born into a royal house would also mean having reporters always on your tail and all the paparazzi that come with it. But it seems Princess Charlotte and Prince William have something in common a hatred for the media. While the public has noticed that Charlotte is very well behaved in public, sometimes she does otherwise. In 2019, the princess, who was four years old at the time, was captured sticking her tongue out while in the audience of a sailing race 
and her father was also said to have been pictured doing likewise at a wedding in 1986. Also, at Prince Louis' christening in 2018, Charlotte cheekily told reporters off, letting them know that they aren't invited. And Prince William is also said to have told reporters off who came for his first day at school when he turned five. He said he didn't like photographers in a childish way. It was very hard to suppress the pride in his face when his daughter was delivering her speech as she wished the England's women's soccer team luck in July 2022. It was so evident by the tightening of his lip that the prince felt happy. At the Platinum Jubilee pageant, even outside Buckingham Palace on the 11th of June 2022, a particular scene caught the eye of spectators. In the video posted by Royal Watchers on Twitter, Charlotte was seen wiping her eyes and laying her head down while her hair was tied back into two plaits. To cheer her up, Prince William bent down and stroked her hair. Also, at King Charles's coronation ceremony, it was beautiful to see her reading the event bulletin while seated next to her father. Lately, on Saturday, June 18, 2023, the Prince of Wales and his only daughter joined other members of the royal family in attending the inaugural Trooping of the Colour of King Charles's reign. Photographers recorded them having a sweet exchange on the balcony of Buckingham Palace. You can't help but notice the striking resemblance between the Prince of Wales and his daughter. Once, when presented with a picture of his younger self, the prince at first thought it was his daughter. He commented and asked if that was him, because he looked just like Charlotte. Fans on social media are not left out, as they keep comparing their pictures. A fan once tweeted, saying how it's eerie how much the princess looks like her father, and another tweeted that both could pass for twins. The public has taken note of how much Prince William and Princess Charlotte look like one another, but what is even more driving is how adorable they are together. Fans haven't been left unimpressed by this, however, as frequent royal watchers have commented on social media about how clear it is that William adores his only daughter. He is her biggest cheerleader, so he builds her self-esteem at every opportunity he has, letting her know she could be as good as her oldest brother during their family matches. This helps erase any trace of sexism in the upbringing of the children. The Cambridges want Charlotte and her brothers to be emotionally sound. The Prince is known to be a mental health enthusiast and co-founder of the Heads Together movement. Having been traumatised by his mother's death and shocked by seeing a little boy badly injured while he was serving as an air ambulance helicopter pilot, the Prince has been open and free about expressing his mental health. He is practical by training his children to be able to express their emotions and feelings as opposed to the tradition in the royal house where feelings are not freely shown. In 2017, he told Calm magazine that emotional intelligence is key and is needed to deal with the complexities of life and relationships. With this mentality, it is evident that the royal kids get emotional support from their parents and this will contribute largely to their character formation and the kind of individuals they will grow up to become, especially for Charlotte being a girl. What do you think about the Cambridge pattern of parenting? Share your thoughts with us in the comments section below. Click here to watch more videos and thank you for watching.